Hi guys, today I'm going to do a video on the B Classy and the B Sassy um, which I think works better as a purse. Um, so this is the two bags and you can see the size difference now between the both. Um, the B Sassy is a lot smaller. I didn't think it was that much smaller from like uh, pictures that I'd seen but it actually is, it is a lot smaller. Um, so there they are side kind of by side so you can see. So the B Classy is uh, huge in comparison. So I'm going to show you what I have packed in my Blooming Romance Classy and then I'll pack it into the Sassy. So when I'm using the Classy as a purse, which I do most of the time just because I really like this bag as a purse. Um, I mean it is pretty big and I don't even use all the pockets but I just kind of like it. So the side bottle pockets, I have nothing in there right now um, and I don't have anything in the cell phone pocket or the change pad pocket at the back. But when you're using this as a purse, it is good to have these free pockets because if you're out and about and you pick up paperwork or other kind of stuff, it's you know this is a great pocket to be able to put all that into. So And also I find if I'm using a classy as a purse and then I then kind of pick some of my kids up or something there is enough room in here to just throw some stuff in for the kids so in the front mommy pocket um, all I have in here I use the sunglass case um, my keys on the fob I have a coin purse in there and just some mints and a pen and that was pretty much it um, like I say, there's tons of room when you're just using this as a purse. I struggled with using it just as a diaper bag because I found it got really heavy and it wasn't really big enough. But this is how the inside's packed. I have a swell bottle in there, that's just the 9 ounce one. And usually if I'm on my own, I will take my book with me or a book um, if I get a chance to read, if I'm hanging around somewhere. I have a small set piece in um, black petals and that's just charger stuff for my phone. I don't have anything else in those mesh pockets. Oh, I do, I have a lip product in there. And in the main part of the bag here, I just have a medium set piece. This is in the Royal Garden. This just has mummy stuff and it's a uh, med kit and the stuff in there for my kids too. I tend to just leave them in a medium set piece. And then there's nothing in this zipper pocket here. And then in this one here, I just have my Be Rich wallet. So that's pretty much all I would carry um, around with me just for myself. So I'm going to go ahead and put it all, see what I can fit into here. So I'll start off with this uh, front pocket here. <clears throat> I think I'm going to put the coin purse in there. And I will attach my keys onto there. And I'll maybe just throw the mints and the pen the pen down there. The mints sorry, I can't have I opened the zip. There we go. I'll put the mints in there and just my lip thing in there. So that's just like that. I'll just go ahead and zip that up. So then it leaves us with the main part of the bag here. So I'm going to go and put this inside, just at the bottom there, I think. I'll put the set piece in the mesh pocket here. <clears throat> My glasses, I think I would just throw them in the side there. Um, I don't know what I'd put in there. I could put my cell phone in there, or I can just go ahead and put my cell phone into the pocket here. Um, I'm just going to throw my wallet in there, so just wallet in there, and I'm going to try the book in the back here, we'll see if it will fit, no, it's not going to fit in there, so I'm going to have to rearrange that, um, I'll try and put this in there, oh, there we go, the medium set piece fits really well into the back there. And that's not something I grab for all the time, so it's okay being back there. And then I will just put the book in here. I might actually stand them up on end like this. And then I have enough room for the swell bottle in that pocket there, so just give you an idea. So there. I've kind of got everything in, and it's stood up. It, it will close. I'll just double check that. Yeah, it does easily close with all that in there, so 
it fits everything in there perfectly. Um, I can't say that I have a preference really between them both. I love it. this that it's like really compact and I've got everything in here, but there wouldn't be much room for anything else. Other stuff that I pick up throughout the day is certainly not going to fit in here too. Whereas the classy, you know, you do have all that extra room that you could put more stuff in. And as I said earlier, um, what I really love about it, if I'm just like coming home quickly and then uh, picking kids up, I can throw stuff in for kids um, into the classy. I certainly wouldn't have the room to do that in here um, with all the stuff that I have in here. So, um, yeah, I don't know which one I prefer. I like this, like I said, because it's nice and small. Um, if I really don't want to carry a huge bag around with me, but I love the classy as a purse, I really do. Um, and I don't mind carrying a bigger bag, but I guess everyone's different and you'll know what you prefer, I guess, once you've tried them both out. But um, I'm really happy that I got the B-Sassy and although the price point is quite high for what you get because you're not getting the change pad, the messenger strap and it's just this like little bag, um, I'm not sure if I would maybe buy another one. Um, if they came in different prints, I'd consider it, but I would hope that the price would be a little lower. I was, I heard that the price was higher just because of the fabric on this, and it is really nice fabric, and it seems very durable, so I don't know. But anyway, if you have any questions, uh, please comment below, and thanks for watching my video.